Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man X. Alright, we're gonna get this started right away. Going to Storm Eagle. Alright, hang on. Uh, okay. Had to adjust my headset. I'm, I'm gonna. Oh, come on! As I said, I was going to cut that out because that was just pretty much, I'm sure that was ear rape for you. No, yeah, no, no, okay, I made it. Coming here first, because this is the second time I recorded it. The, uh, I just tried recording this about 10 minutes ago, and I got like 12 minutes into the recording, and I had to go upstairs to talk to my dad because, uh, here's a funny little story. Yesterday, I got ta er, I got called into the main office to talk to the principal because apparently I'm not taking hard enough uh, classes for my level. The principal thinks that I can take harder classes because I've been in the top 20th percent for ITBS and ITEDS ever since third grade. So I got switched into an, an AP class, AP Language and Composition. Sounds fun. And I was in there until about what well, about halfway through my second to last class yesterday is when I went in there and I was there for the rest of the school day because apparently the principal forgot he called oh shit me and like three other people to down to talk to him so we were sitting there waiting for him for about 45 minutes before we even talk to him and I didn't even get to talk to him by the time it came up to be my turn it, like school was five minutes from being out and I still had to go and get my stuff back from my classroom because I left it in there and get out to get outside to wait for my friend otherwise I wasn't gonna get a ride so today I had to, I had to go in and talk to him at eight o'clock in the morning and I got to wait about 20 minutes to talk to him and then I talked to him for about five minutes and then told me that I'm switching to AP comp and then I had to go and wait in the counselor's office to get to actually get my schedule changed for about a half an hour because my counselor was in there talking to some family about something. So I so yesterday I got marked absent for my last class, and my dad wasn't happy about that. He didn't really believe me when I said I was talking to the principal. So I told him that I'm going back to talk to him today. I'll have him call you. Well, the principal said he'd call him. And since I and apparently he didn't, according to my dad, and uh, so since I was in there all this morning, I also got marked absent for my second class today. And uh, so since the principal didn't call my dad, I got in trouble again. That was fun. But, do we have everything? Yeah, we have everything. Every upgrade except for the gun and then these last two Maverick weapons. But yeah, so this is the second time I recorded it. And the other time, like, I beat the two Mavericks and I was in the middle of getting the gun upgrade when, uh, what the, where's... Oh crap! Oh man, I did. I did a uh, last time. I did Stink Chameleon first, and I just realized that this uh, this guy is weak against Stink Chameleon's weapon, for, and I just like totally blanked that I didn't have it. So I get to fight him with the with the X Buster. Actually, it'd probably be easier with this, just because it follows him. Wow, it does like nothing for damage though. Come on, there we go. Uh, ooh, missed. Ha. But yeah, Storm Eagle. He is actually in Mega Man X six, I believe. One of the Mavericks you fight. He uh. His power is like call dead Mavericks, and one of the ones he calls 
is Storm Eagle. And when you kill him, you get that power to, su to summon Storm Eagle. Like this movie's doing now with his like thing from the side. That's what he does when you summon him. But he's like all metallic and looks like he's made of metal. I, I don't exactly remember his name. I think it's Metal Junk Player. And that's you may be thinking like, why the hell is it Metal Junk Player? Well, in Japan, the L and the R are essentially the same. There's no difference between them. So originally his name is supposed to be Metal Junk Prayer. And it's like he prays and brings back dead Mavericks to fight for him. That's the whole... That's the reasoning behind him. But I'm not sure if that's his name or not. If, if it's not, I'll put in some editing magic back when I was just talking about it. But this weapon... Oh my god, it is a game breaker. I'm almost sad that I got it this late in the game. Because it just rapes. And before we go do Steam Chameleon, we're going to go and we're going to get the gun upgrade. Just because I want to show you how awesome it is. Uh, da 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 da! Ah, uh, itchy nose. Yeah. Wee. Oh, I missed. Damn. 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 Oh, no! I did that same thing last time. Ah, I can't get up there now. Man, gotta freaking leave the level and come back now. Uh. Man, I don't think we're gonna have time to get the secret weapon in this video. Actually, you know what? Screw it. I don't care. This is just gonna be a long video. We're just gonna go and we're gonna get the secret weapon in this video. Actually, I think I might cut it into two videos. And then just upload them right after each other. Actually, that doesn't really make any sense. So, I'm gonna put them both in this video. I'm gonna get it get the secret weapon in this video. Yes! 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 I did it! I did it! Yeah! Alright. Okay. X is- his arm is blue. And his hand is white. I think all this does is like it changes it. It makes his hand blue and his arm white. Yeah, that's all it did. It just switched the color of his arms and his hand. But yeah, this is what it does when it's fully charged. It lets you charge up to purple and do that. It's the same one you get at the end of the game. But now I'm gonna show off all the fully charged things. Um, all the weapons look the same. Like if you were charged up to the yellow and fired, it would be the same as if you just fired it. The only difference is if you charge up to the purple. This is the ice one. Uh, what's this do? I don't remember what this does. Ooh, that's what that does. Oh, I remember what this one does. What? Oh, I missed. I didn't charge it long enough, I mean. This creates a shield. Oh, man. That was a shitty shield. It disappeared almost immediately. This one, you have to keep shooting it. And, oh, man. Come on. Screw you. This, that's what it does. Ooh, this, the Game Breaker. It's charged up thing isn't actually all that good. Just that. This one, this one's pretty nice. Right there. Oh, um, I'm not sure what this does. Let's find out. Oh, sweet. And yep, that's all of them. All of them except for Stink Chameleons, and Stink Chameleons is pretty nice, too. But, we're off to Stink Chameleon stage now. Yes, we now have everything except for Stink Chameleon's weapon and the heart tank in here. I do not believe we've gotten that. Yeah, we haven't because I just got it in that last time I recorded this. It's the first thing I did. But yeah, as you can see, there's water down here now. That's because we beat Launch Octopus's stage. 
which you need to do in order to get the heart tank here. What the, what the hell am I doing? This is just such a game breaker. Alright, this is gonna be too much of a hassle with all you rocks here. Destroying these rocks can be a bit of a, a bit difficult because you have to kick off of them. Woo! And there it is, last heart tank of the game. No! No! Ugh! My god. Just look at this. It's just destroying. Whew. Damn it, I knew you were going to be there. There's actually one ROM version of Mega Man X that makes it... Whoa. Oh my god, I'd never noticed that. Apparently these falling things don't hurt you. I guess it's because you, I have the helmet thing and lets you destroy things. Because normally that hurts me. Those fa blocks falling on X like normally hurts him. But as I was saying, there's one uh, ROM of this that makes it to where every time you hit an invincible enemy, like when Chill Penguin is sliding, and those rock things when they fell on the ground before they like turn like before they look like uh, people, they just look like a big rock. If you shoot an or shoot an invincible enemy, it instantly takes you to the end of the stage as if you just beat it. That's always nifty. Sinking in the mud. Alright, it's almost the oh, yeah. yeah, this ride armor is like amazing. You can't take any damage as long as you're in it. Where is it? Boomer Kuwanger's weapon is what this guy is weak against. This is actually going to be a really long part before I edit it. You'll see why uh, when I go to get the secret weapon. There's going to be a lot of outtakes. Let's just say that. Shit. Ah. Yeah, if you jump and shoot this, then it, like, uh, curves down instead of up. Like that. But still, this guy is a huge pain in the ass without his, the uh, Boomer Kuwinger's weapon. <coughs> oh. Boo! Yawn! But with that, I do believe we have everything in the game, except for the secret weapon. Alright, and the- oh, I forgot about this scene. Alright, I'm right behind you, Zero. I just gotta go grab something first. And the secret weapon is in Armored Armadillo stage. I'm gonna show you how to get it. Okay, you're gonna wanna kill this bat and get at least five lives. How many do I have? Three. Because uh, you actually need to kill yourself five times. You don't need to kill yourself. It just makes it a lot easier if you do. I'll explain more on that in a bit. But I'm gonna get... Oh, how many is that? Six? Yeah, six. That'll be plenty. Just want one. An extra one just in case I fuck up. I keep forgetting that I have this. Fill up my sub tanks there.
Oh, I'm actually not looking forward to the battle with with uh, Sigma. Actually, I don't, I don't think I've mentioned that, but Sigma's like the main bad guy. He's a Maverick. He was the leader of the Maverick Hunters, but he became Maverick. Okay. Actually, care for a history lesson on the in the Mega Man X universe? Uh, Doctor, no, not Doctor. Sigma. He was the head of the Maverick Hunters, and he he was there when they f discovered Zero. They found Zero in like an abandoned factory, and Zero was a Maverick. He tried. He killed everyone who came in there. So Sigma was like, alright, I'm the leader, I'll go fight him. So they fought. Um, it was, pretty, it was a pretty even match, actually. And uh, the battle ended with uh, Zero, like, Zero was about to kill Sigma, and then something happened to Zero, and he got in, like, a shitload of pain. And, uh, okay, actually, hang on, this part is kind of important, so you can fuck it up. Jump, okay, and come and get this. And jump off and kill yourself. You have to do this five times. Five times. But after I finish explaining to this, I'll just cut to when I get the capsule. But, so they fought, and the battle ended with Sigma uh, punching the crystal on Zero's forehead and cracking it. And that is what, uh, that is how Sigma became a Maverick. He got, he got it from Zero. And, uh, so yeah, that's a neat little interesting tidbit of information. But, like, Sigma, he didn't go Maverick immediately. Like, him and Zero were friends before he became Maverick. And, uh, kill myself. Alright, I'm gonna cut it here, and I'll just meet you to when I get the, uh, secret weapon. So, see you then. Jump! Woo! I made it! I made it! Okay. Welcome back. This! It's the secret. What the hell is Dr. Light wearing? He is wearing... Oh, whatever the hell they call it. The thing that Ryu wears from Street Fighter. That's right. This is the secret weapon. Wait for it. Wait for it! The Hadouken! 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 And this, this Hadouken, you shoot it the same way you shoot it in Street Fighter, Street Fighter, down, down forward, or forward, and then, uh, the fire button, and it one hits everything, everything, everything in the game, it kills it in one hit, it'll even kill the final boss in one hit, but you, you need full health to use it. Oh wow, I filled up all my sub tanks, that's awesome, that'll really help against in the final area. Oops, wrong button. Come on. Here we go. Alright. So, I think that's it for this part. So, next time on Let's Play Mega Man X, we're going to start Sigma's Castle. So, see you then.